Welcome aboard the fourth episode of the The Haunterville campaign. We are playing as uh, the fox's son. We're playing as King Bohemond. The, uh, the guy. The, um... Oh, I'm not a bastard. I thought I was a bastard, but uh, I suppose not. Was, was my mother married to my father then? My sister's a legitimized bastard. Why am I not? Is it because I'm king? Did that just get rid of it? Anyway, I, I wish to take over the uh, Byzantine Empire. So what I think the plan is here is to swear fealty to the Emperor and then take him over. I believe that is the way to go. So we're going to do that. I'm going to start right away. With the swearing of the fealty. My liege, I am now a part of the Byzantine Empire. And uh, how do I go about this? Hostile, claim thrown, it is a scheme. I have a 47% success chance. I get a pressed claim on the Byzantine Empire. Okay. If it's kept secret, I avoid the prestige loss. I do have a fair bit of prestige, and I would like more. More prestige means easier to get my allies on board with this war. Also, awesome money payments, 49 out of 50, and 50. Okay, I might as well just take all this money now. So I have uh, my 3,000 troops. I can afford more. I can afford more siege equipment, which is not the most important thing, or more men. I think having a few more men would be grand, but I think instead what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this money on the intrigue. I can invite people to join my stuff here. Can I? They probably don't like me due to my religion. Oh, this guy, uh, Valeria. She could be bribed for 55 gold. Fuck it, not worth it. Not worth it. This will take four years. Ah. Okay, well, um, right. What else can I do with this money? Well, I can gain a bit more prestige. Let's call a hunt. Let's go on a hunt, shall we? Let's hope that the Emperor does not fuck with us anytime soon. It's a pretty strong empire. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it stays strong under our control. Illegal prey, poachers, here in the despot's woods. They huddle together as I ride up with my guards, making a poor job of hiding the dead boar behind them. We did not do this, your mercy. Their blades and bows belie their words. Ah. I could potentially gain money and prestige. Let's take a bit of a risk there. Oh, it's 40 to 60. Ha. Huh. Okay, let's have poaching training for a little bit then, instead. Wait, hang on a second. The Basalis is under attack from this guy with no men, so it's not really that big of an issue. My scheme, however, has been discovered. The existence of the claim throne has been exposed. My involvement is yet unknown, but we have taken a huge hit. Also, we do get our prestige there. I have taken a huge hit here. I'm at 17% chance, whereas secrecy is a bit lower there. What else can I get through here? Truth is relative, yes. Swift execution, that's not exactly it. Finding secrets, court of shadows, prepared for anything. Enemy hostile scheme, success chance against your courtiers, minus minus. Where do I want to be? Dark insights? No. I think I want to be here. Digging for dirt and kidnapper. Twice uh, scheme schema. I think we already have the best we can. We'll uh, keep going down this anyway. I'm sure eventually something will occur. What I might want is more shekels. But let's have a look and see what we can do with you. You could increase control somewhere or you could just keep doing your job. You there, domestic affairs. Direct vassals. I don't care for direct vassals. Convert, fabricate. Uh, there's not much I can do here. We'll keep her managing domain. She might be able to help us with money. Let's just hope it all goes according to plan. Because uh, that is not the best of starts. No, it is not. Three years for a 17% chance is not great. Especially when there's no uh, invites at all. Why are the invites so low? You is terrified of the Abyssalius. Of course you are. Uh, you the minus 35, you have nothing to gain. Uh, opinion of me. Let's sort by acceptance. Who's closest? Duke Loanus. Reluctancy and opinion. So we could... It says here I can't bribe him, but I could still sway this man. And he is relatively uh, likely to join. So we'll give it a bit of a go. You can be convinced still for a little bit of money, so we will... I'll crack it. I need all the help I can get, and she is relatively helpful. My son here could become content. Oh, sure. Not the best for Bertrand, but I'll take it. 
She has put me back up to 25% chance. I need the foolish man here to join us. I just need a bit more opinion with him. Uh, what if I were to be able to get alliances with these people? You there, who are you? You're just a, a lady in his court. What if I were to uh, arrange marriage between you and this guy? No, it's, it's not going to gain our opinion. Oh, we'll try with the, the Duke there. Hopefully that will come to fruition and we'll be in a grand position for it. All of these people here should be serving me. A call to war. Hungary is calling me to war against this guy. He looks like he would be able to win easily enough, so we will join it. Hopefully there's nothing I have to do. Oh, it looks like it's just peasants anyway. Yeah, he'll, he'll destroy them. Peasants are not any real concern, are they? Ah, Valeria has been discovered, and she's been placed under lock and key. Ha. Ah. Has, oh, he will not be a uh, fort of a tyrant, as there is reason for it. That's no good. Let's have a look at this here. So we're back down to 17%, and still nobody is likely to join us here at all. And if he finds out about me, then he's going to have me arrested. I do have the friends to deal with it, though. Swing this guy is going quite well. Can I not buy or fabricate a hook? It will take four years, and it would um, fix that one there. I, if this one fails, I can go the longer way and try and fabricate hooks to get people on my side there. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm quite aware that if I were to serve as the Bessalius of the Byzantine Empire, I require the support of my now fellow vassals more than... The Baselius currently has. Illustrating how generous I would be as Baselius could go a long way. 85 gold, we gain everybody opinion. Very good. Very good. Just what we need. We have gained another agent. And it is uh, Loanus. He has joined us. We're going to go ahead and cancel this now. Abandon that. We're going to go and try and work on somebody else instead. Uh, somebody relatively good. Baron Uros does have 16. But then you're at 30. And you're a bit closer. So we're going to sway you instead. Next, it still does take two years, and you're three years away, so it should come through. It should. Nobody here can be bribed, which is a shame. I mean, if I had more money, something like Zenibos, Zenibu, Zeniboy, whatever, whoever he is, he will um, become a part of this. Um, can my allies win this war without me having to go over there and deal with it? Household savings. Excellent. My wife has gave me some money. And an agent has joined the scheme there. We now have two. Baroness Eusebia has joined us. Thank you very much for your help there. It's a shame I just cannot do anything about bribing these people. Maybe if I had more money it would be more feasible. I just, I don't know. Hungary now is still not marching north. Um, available perks. What here is going to help me? Murder scheme is not useful. Disrupt scheme is not useful. Find secrets, progress, not so useful. Abduction scheme, prepare for anything. Job well done. This is what I need. But I don't think I'm going to get to it on time. But we'll, we'll try our best. We'll try. We will definitely try. Is there anything I can do with my council member here? Support scheme. Okay, good. That's probably going to help us a fair bit. Can I also get my wife? Yeah, we're at 90% now. Can I get my wife to join in here too? Uh, court intrigue. Now help me a bit more. Excellent, we're up to 90% with 95% secrecy. We should be able to win here. Should. We'll uh, hope that the other people do stay in the, uh, in the gang now. Getting personal. In our recent communication, do Dukes Nikephoros of Athens expressed a want to focus on his ambitions and interests more. I could make sure that our coming letters contain more on a topic close to his heart. He's very uh, stewardship-wise. Ruling of a realm, I think that is what would he impress him. Excellent, we have gained opinion with this man. Very good. Maybe not enough to have him join the uh, gang, though. No, uh, it's not really moved at all. A shame you can't just simply buy a hook if you were super super good there. What is this? As with so many other things, my half-brother Roger sees eye to eye with me on the matter of Baselius Andrianos is not in not being fit to rule the Byzantine Empire. I can think of far better candidates, he lets me know in confidence, and you stand first among them. Give the word and you will have my support. 
Friendship is the most honourable form of loyalty, or spend your efforts letting others know how successful I am. Um, support from a friend. Yeah, I think I would rather gain that. Support from Roger, my brother. Yes. We'll make you a lord, Roger. Don't you worry. You'll be, uh, rewarded for your help here. It's still 90%, but it is still three years away. I took Bertrand out playing with a bow, and to my surprise he ran into a wounded doe. He later lashed out at me, thinking I had staged the whole encounter as some sort of test. Become paranoid. We don't want him to become paranoid. Ambitious is good, though. We will gain some stress, but becoming ambitious with my son, my son becoming ambitious is a very good thing. I clearly do not stand alone in my ambition to rule a Byzantine Empire. Ravens have been gathering on the roofs of uh, Basilius Adrianus' castle, and a few nights ago, even the stars seem to be falling all over the Byzantine Empire. Peasants and nobles alike whisper that it is a sign that Adrianus has lost favour with the gods. Let's do it. Let's give him some ill omens. Any progress is good progress. Ah, good, we have a picture there. Um, still at 90%. Nobody else has joined yet. Ivanka is not entirely useless. This guy's a bit further away now, Duke Fyodoros. Wait, that's not the guy I'm going after. I'm going after... Uh, Nicodrios. Well, he's gone right down on this list then. He's not here at all. So I'm going to cancel that swaying. Yes. I'm going to sway instead. Uh, Ivanka. Sway. Could try and seduce instead, but no, we'll just go with a simple sway. See if we can get her to join us here. Very good. Shame that the uh, other guy didn't seem to really work. But worse of things have happened. Also then comes the question, do we stay Catholic or do we switch our religion and try to fix the uh, religion here to Catholic? I'm not too sure. A Satru would be the way to go. Uh, there was a commotion among the children today. Mabel was attempting to preach among her fellow youngsters and, become the targ and became the target of a small fight. Bertrand intervened and did what he could to protect her. Very good man. Pensive, brave, content, and opportunity. He has four traits now. Oh, they all do. Oh, you don't. But children do. I hope that's to do with the update, or will they lose one? Because having just three is, is not very good. It's really not. Also, do I still have an alliance with Normandy? I don't, but I'm married into Normandy. Oh, Normandy, uh... They appear to have become a bit weaker. Also, Godwins have taken over England again. Huh. Well, uh, you are a Normandy, Kavros. Can we negotiate an alliance? We can. Good. Oh, you're in a war. Of course you're in a war. Of course I, I go for it now when you're at war. Ay ay ay. I need to remember to check these damn things. Negotiate an alliance there. I'm probably going to be called into war of England. Marvellous news. Yeah, he can afford to call me there. And he will. If I refuse, I lose 350. I can accept. I can af afford to accept uh, the declining, if that makes any sense at all. Humphrey, Count Abelord's son and heir, is firmly in my grip. However, with the right strategy, I might raise my upper hand even further. Perhaps Humphrey could be used to extend my influence over the Count. At least I do gain 100 XP uh, there, so I will go through with it. Humphrey could find no incriminating evidence and fa about Count Abelard. Uh, so it was good thing I had prepared it myself. All of a sudden, Ebelard seems to be bes beset by foul rumour, and I happen to hold all the evidence for them. I get a strong hook on Count Ebelhard. Let's do it. Count Ebelhard, strong hook. Thank you. Can I then blackmail him for money? I can straight up demand payment. Well, I'll do that. Thank you, sir. I could use that to get more bowmen, or could we get a friend in here? Still at 90% with the agents. There's still nobody I can bribe in, so I think instead I will spend it on a few hundred more men. I have 500 heavy troops, 500 horsemen, 500 bowmen. I think for my economy, bowmen might be the best. They're ones I can actually afford. Or there's more siege equipment, which will be very useful to try and get through here, because my allies can come through this way. Uh, I do have a few sieges I would have to do. Plus, I would have to sail across as well. No, I think bowmen. I think siege equipment. Let's take some siege equipment here. Some more mangonels. And we'll take up all of that money there. 
Salt in the wounds. While I was at the market with Mabel, her attention was caught by a criminal change in the pillory. Mabel watched him for a while when he did nothing but cough and make water. Mabel rolled her eyes and kept on walking. Yeah, well, well done, Mabel. Mabel of Sicily. How about my other daughter, Matilda? I haven't heard of her much from her at all. Let's give an education in stewardship. My son knows turning out very well. His intrigue is at 11, his martial at 10. He's, he's doing good. I will have to make sure to unmark him from the uh, from the knighthood, though. Oh, my sister, the the Queen of Hungary, has died. She was killed during a siege Ah, uh, at only 39. She did have a lot of children, though. Princess Cunilda of Hungary. Ah, good. My niece, who is betrothed to the Duke Svensson of Gilland. Does that mean I can get anything with you? Negotiate lights? I can! And he's not at war, so we'll take that as well. What about your other siblings? Who are they married into? Anybody around here? Haunterville? Oh, you're married into us. No, well, extra friend is always good. I won't uh, be mad at an extra friend. No, they're married now. Uh, Matilda, my half-sister, is now married to Prince Reynaud of France. So we are allied to France? Yes, of course we are. Very good. Very good. He's still at nine and a half thousand, still allied to the uh these lot down in Africa. The Nubians. Excellent, we now can claim the throne. After all my hard work, it is finally time to present the evidence I have come across that I am in fact the rightful heir to the Byzantine Empire. Through an old dynastic dynastic marriage. Basilius and Adrianios will be nothing more than a simple pretender as long as he stands in my way. Soon I shall rule the Byzantine Empire. It's got to it, 90% surely. Excellent, finally, no one can doubt the fact that I have a reasonable claim on the Byzantine Empire. While the exact details of the old dynastic marriage are shrouded in the mists of time, there is no reason to doubt its veracity. Even Basilius and Adrianus must admit my claim is a legitimate one. Nothing can stop me now. Yeah, it's no longer able to do it, because I do have it. I have a claim on the Byzantine Empire. Very good. So can we go to factions here? And can we create a claimant faction for myself? I can. Oh, start it. Uh, I can't add members. There's nobody who can be forced to join. Opinion of me? Are, you, are we sure we can't invite you here? I can't force them, but maybe they will join by their own merit. One member has joined. Me. Oh, <laughs> of course it's me. Uh, hostile scheme chance. We'll take that. I would appreciate it. I can't go for a kidnapping, though. We don't quite have that about us, but we do have murder. If I did so much. No. I could kill his wife, though. That would get rid of his alliance if I were able to murder her. 55% chance in 11 months. Although they are very far away. This might be worth just keeping. It might be worth keeping. If we were to declare the war now for my claims, I would have... Now he would have that many. I would have all of my friends. So he would be... Oh, jeez. France. Holy Roman Empire. Yeah, we've got this in the bag. Basically, all of Europe will ally to place me on the throne of Byzantium. So we are going to do it. Let me just make sure I've got everything in order first. I've got all my alliances. Is there anybody else we could even try and get? Um, I have a daughter here. What could we do with you? Alliance power, France again, Poland. Yeah, not too useful. It's all the same people again because I probably have too many alliances. Uh, I can't do anything with money, unfortunately. I do have all of my court here. Happy to do my bidding. Um, faction. We'll give this a little. We'll give it a month tick. No, nobody has joined, and I can't ask anyone about it. Okay. Well, I'm going to end the episode here because it's in a perfect spot for doing the war over the next episode. Hopefully, I will also take the uh, Byzantion capital here. I would like that. And we just need to try and uh, secure our realm. People probably won't like me much. I might have to change religion. I don't think being Catholic is going to work. Being Norman, though, no? we'll definitely uh, keep that. Actually, did I ever become culture head? No, I still did not. It's still, uh, it's a Conterville, actually, over here. I don't know why, I'm definitely stronger than you. 
Oh well, thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this campaign so far. If you have, remember to subscribe. Subscribing is great. It makes you uh, keep up to date on all channel content. I have many series going on. I think uh, Somalia is still going on. It might have just ended. I am uh, not too sure. If it has just ended, well, my bad. But <laughs> it was a good campaign. Also, there's Armenia. There is uh, the Empire of Leon. There is... Um, Irish Empire, there is the Norwegian Empire, the F uh, Finlander Empire, um, Vikings in Egypt, Vikings in India. I've done all sorts of campaigns, so go ahead and check them out. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. I do greatly appreciate it. Goodbye.